Uh, hello, this is Daniel Kim we are with Medical Spirotech. Uh, our core technology, uh, Spirotech protein, is patent, a scalable medication for the chronic wound. Uh, there is a better source. It can be divided by the four stages. One and two stages uh, that are medical treatment. However, there is no treatment at a three and four and the medical expense are four to 10 times more than the stage one and two. But that's a big issue in the US as well as in Korea uh, since uh, patients are, are increasing by the aging societies and the other disease. Uh, to resolve the, uh, the market in the US, uh, uh, total market, wound healing market is 27 billion and the patch itself is two billion market and the 2.5 million are suffering from bad source in the U.S. Uh, that's a big issue in the, in the U.S. as well. Uh, with the silk uh, uh, protein, we try to resolve these issues. Uh, spider silk protein has been very famous biomaterial over 2,000 years. And even sex peers mentioned the spider web to heal the wound by the spider web at his book called Midsummer Night Dream. So people know spider is a really good biomaterial in healing, but we cannot make it massively because when get the one place, uh, spider seed protein kill one another. Uh, that's why we cannot have uh, the spider seed protein uh, massively. However, uh, our company, Medical Spider, complete a uh, uh, massive production of a silk protein by recombinant microorganism. That is uh, possible by the Professor Lee, my co-founders, uh, developed a massive production of a silk protein. And uh, now Dr. Kim and uh, Professor Lee's uh, uh, students and making the silk protein. And uh, my co-founder, Dr. Yu, apply the silk protein onto the skin tissue rejuvenations. So we all four together founded the company in 2018 and uh, tried to resolve the issue at a better source at stage three and four. So one senior uh, in Houston uh, is brother cancer and uh, couldn't uh, heal his damages uh, by using other uh, treatment. Uh, but he, he, his foot is healed with our spirochic protein patches in six weeks. So he might even need to cut uh, his toe, but our spirochic protein patches they healed uh, his foot completely. So to confirm it's really healed the, the chronic wound in, in a cell, so we tested with an uh, intraviral microscope and uh, we, when we compare with the positive and neg negative control on day uh, seven, the scar size on day seven with the seal is much smaller and much faster healed than the positive control. So that's why we conclude spirochic protein is really healed wound care like a bad source. So compare with the other product available at the market, we compare with the pump type, stem cell, and growth factors. Uh, the spirochic protein patches itself only the antibacterial and anti-inflammatory, and the uh, stem cell and the cross factory patches need to be stored at the minus 20 Celsius, but uh, ours can be keep at a uh, room temperature, and the price also have a competitiveness. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, completing the uh, mass production of silk protein. First three years, now we try to commercialize with uh, uh, spirochic protein uh, uh, patches. So we now apply the uh, second class at Korea FDA, and we prepare prepare for the U.S. FDA and try to compete in two years. So we can apply the, our technology to the burning and pet market, and huge demand from the military. They need a lot of. Uh, uh, patches for the uh, skin wound. And uh, our revenues will be increased by dramatically since uh, if we have the 
uh, Korea FDA next year, US FDA in, in two years. So we will be the break even in 2027. So we need a 35 million uh, and the 10, 10 million for the uh, GMP certified uh, manufacturing facilities, 25 million for the clinical tasks and the operation in the US. Then 2027, will be in a break even and then revenue and the profit will be dramatically increased after that. Uh, so medical biotech is core tag is to legitimate the skin tissues by the number one biological protein producers. Thank you.